with some life insurance policy shit on, so there could be some information coming out about life insurance policies. Uh, somebody asked me to do a little while ago, what's up, if I could do a reading on what's up with your neighbors. Hold on. All right, so uh, I'm going to do that for you guys. All right, I've seen prostitute when I first split the card. So your neighbor, one of your neighbors could be a prostitute. One could be a gambler. This could be both. I just saw a prostitute and a gambler card. Mystic, they could be fucking with that, um, like some kind of magic, mirror magic or candle magic for some of you. Let's see uh, what they want to talk about. What's up with the collective's uh, neighbors, please? Shapeshifter. Hmm? Look, shapeshifter. Fear of intimate union. So I also feel like if you're in this upright, like this virgin spirit, you could be celibate. So that could mean something like in the future. Okay, let's see. Another brick in the wall. So somebody could be trying to put a brick in your wall. And we said before that that means like somebody trying to stop you, like put a wall in between where you're going. It could be a wall between you and somebody else or a wall that's going to keep trying to keep you from going somewhere. Okay. There were certain teachers, I don't know, who would what the children any way they could. So there could be something about a child here or children or something. Can you show me yes, please? Can you show me yes? Thank you. Can you show me no? Thank you. Can you clear that? Psychopathic break, psychopathic break, crash down. So there's a psychopath some around someone that's crashing. Thank you. We don't need no education. So somebody could have a very, like not, they're not very educated. Oh, hold on. Let's see. Sorry. Is today July 7th? Thank you. 2022. Leave them kids alone. Somebody could be doing something with a child or, or um, just being mean to a child here. Is this shapeshifter uh, in the upright here? No. Is this, is this virgin in the upright here? That's exactly what I thought. So the shapeshifter is your neighbor. Narcissist energy. Uh, I will be whoever you need me to be because I am, I have ulterior motive. Okay. Somebody has ulterior motive. Project any image that serves your personal agenda in the moment is what this is in Elo attribute. You are pure. So you attracted this person. Yeah. It's, it's, a. Um, it's just a natural thing or they were, well, for some of you, you're just attracting this kind of energy. For others of you, they were purposely sent to you. This could be somebody that's entitled. For some of you, this has something to do with a hit. Okay, so let's just see. Somebody else hates you, I just saw. <laughs> hates you. Somebody's sister-in-law hates you. Stay away from this person. So you guys don't go near this person, whoever this oh soulless being and hired a hitman. Look at them too, flipped out. So somebody near you, this could be uh, current energy or past energy, but there's a soulless being that is connected to this person or this is the person that hired a hitman. Now this hitman doesn't have to be somebody um, that, that kills you with a gun or a knife. They could do it spiritually. They could want you to kill yourself, do it with electronic harassment. They could have thought that you were a party or they were going to put something in your drink, your pot. You know what I'm saying? There's all different ways they could do it covertly now because there's just too much exposure. There's cameras everywhere and, uh, you know, there's cameras in the TVs, okay? I had to put tape over the fucking sensor on the TV because I know that the government watches the. It's like I understand um, certain shit that, that just I understand it's more than just somebody spying on you that's watching. So that's why these people never get away with what they think they're going to get away with. Everything is seen everywhere. All right, so anyway, so... What else can you tell me? Thank you. They're supposed to be torturing you. You're torturing them. This comes out a lot um, where when they came for somebody that's stronger than them, they have a hard time admitting that you're stronger than them. And then that's cool. You know what I mean? Like we're okay with that. We can show you better than we can tell you though. So whoever this is for you, uh, you're showing them. You're torturing this person. So they were they were sent to you to uh, take you out, I'm guessing. And... and you're, they're being tortured. Okay. Yeah. 
Tell me why. Tell me more about this, please. Who is this? What, so what's up with this? There's a Gemini or you're a Gemini or it's two people. But, oh, yeah, I feel like something keeps going back or it's like whatever they're trying to do to you and whatever this is, it keeps going back. That's what it is. It's like somebody, it's like juggling, but juggling with, I feel like this is mental instability here. Tell me more. Two of Pentacles. They're watching you too with this. This is always like a set of eyeballs to me too, okay? That they're that's like they're all eyes are on you. Tell me more. These people can't rub two nickels together, or this person that's also like my two nickels card, right? They're watching a Leo, or or yeah, look, look at you, look at you. This is healing energy, happiness, happiness. I feel like you're happy by yourself, you're an introvert. Yeah, it's tough for this person to do whatever this was. It's like, uh, I mean, I feel like someone's juggling, like, but the idea, it's almost like, I mean, is this working? Am I being tortured? Am I basically like torturing my own self? And am, am I, is what I'm trying to do, it's almost like somebody showed up. It's like you show up to a fight. And the other person just doesn't show up because they're too big for it. And then you wind up punching yourself in the face and knocking yourself out. I used to be a rolling stone. Cause a fight. Yeah. This person's like a roll. Papa was a rolling stone. Wherever he laid his hat was his home. So this could be somebody that does that. Your neighbor could be somebody that just they'll go wherever they're allowed, you know. Tell me more. There's a divine masculine, possibly Virgo or a Leo that's involved or on one side of this. They're spying. Look, they're also being watched. You know that my page of swords and the hermit is my investigator together. They're being watched. They're being investigated here. It could be by an actual female with the queen of swords. It could be a female investigator. Uh, yeah, this person could be like, um, cause this to me, like with the juggling, it's like uh, going back and forth, right? Going back and forth with what? Because I, I think it's like, it's, um, peace of mind. My daddy never had, so they could be just like their daddy, this person. But I, I think that, um, somebody's kind of teetering with the fact of like, they may be being watched here. Shine the light. Yeah. There's some light. Look, 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 what does this look like? Shine the light, shine the light. Somebody shined the light on this situation, and now I feel like they're being investigated. Somebody made a bad move coming for somebody here. One of your one of your neighbors here, they're stuck now. They're stuck now. I think they're like mesmerized by somebody. Look, look, mesmerized by somebody. They thought they were gonna confuse you or they were gonna be able to like, I don't know, what, talk to you. And try to pull some fucking words out here too with the page of swords and the seven cups. It's like confusion with words. I think somebody was really banking on the fact that they were going to be able to con like connect with somebody and that they were going to be able to confuse them and maybe get some information. They wanted to see how much somebody knew about something or somebody that they're connected to. That's what this is. Oof. Good old family home. This could be a family member or somebody. You, yours, or they wear glasses. This person wears glasses, okay? That's another thing that this could be, too. Now that I'm looking at this, this could be eyeglasses. So this person wears eyeglasses, hired a hitman. They could be this hitman. Soulless being, red hair. Ancestors are so proud of you. So whoever has the red hair, okay? It could be a Leo, a Virgo, whatever. Virgo, I just saw. Um, they're very proud of you. Because I'm guessing that you picked up on this. And this is why they're being tortured themselves. You're torturing them. So your ancestors are probably giving you a lot of shit in your dreams. Or Sagittarius. There could be a Sagittarius. Or they're, they're proud of you, Sagittarius. They have no idea what they're doing. Puppets. Narcissists. You're protected by the law. So maybe this is why, like, you just put your 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 faith in the universe. Like, well, I mean, I can expose some shit, or you're aware of this. I feel like, shine the light. I keep being drawn to that. Shine the light. Yeah, that's it. 
Sagittarius, either you have a Sagittarius ancestor that's very proud of you, or you are the Sagittarius or it's highly aspected in your chizzy. Okay, so whoever this person is, they wear glasses, they're spying, they know they're being watched, or they don't, they don't, or whatever, that's irrelevant, right? But, um, this is somebody that was sent to you to do some dirty shit to this pure spirit, and that's why it's not going to work, that's why it's not going to work. They, the, because of this virgin coming out, I feel like a lot of you were celibate, whether you're with somebody or not, you guys could be celibate together, but whatever it was, I feel like somebody thought they were going to come in and schmooze you, they could have been told by somebody else that sent them that you were a prostitute or that you were easy, and they thought it was like easy, easy, and, and here you're celibate, like somebody told a bunch of lies to somebody, and now somebody got themselves like uh, in, in a hole or something that they can't get out of. I think the person that they trusted to, that sent them to you didn't care about the consequences of what this person was going to get themselves into. It's like they're an enemy, like a known enemy, like a known enemy. Yep. All right, let's see. Illegally on unemployment, I saw, so that's for somebody. Let's see. Tell me more, please. Tell me more karmic father. So I don't know. That could be a Sagittarius was a karmic father. This, they could have a karmic or they are a karmic father. So a karmic father for me, okay, is this. They were fired from somewhere. Um, I don't take care of my children. I can't show love to my children. Uh, I should have never had them. Um, I would have been better off like a lot of these karmic masculines, these narcissists, these soulless beings are like uh, closet gay, they would have been better off, no disrespect to any uh, gay men or anything, but just putting it in somebody's ass, because at least at that point, there's no pregnancy that happens, you know, <laughs> I mean, like, one good thing about, about that is, is like, I'm not saying one good thing, I know of really, like, a lot of cool gay guys, they were some of my favorite people, but I'm talking about, like, the ones that do it, because they just want to piss people off, or they want to get people's attention, or I'm mad at my mommy and daddy, and I, let's overdo everything, and it's like disrespecting what, what it really stands for, those people, okay, and the ones that are, that uh, use women uh, for opportunities, but they're banging dudes in, in, the, in the background, that's the problem, I don't mind the ones that openly are gay, and they're loving people, and they fit in with society, and they're cool and they don't call scenes of bars and shit and, 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 and in stores and those, you know, but the ones that like to cause trouble because you are not, you're not comfortable with, with your sexual preference. Wanted, did all alive. You can't make this shit up. Thank you, spirit guys. I love you guys so fucking much. One, two, three, four. Somebody's wanted. Dead or alive. It looks, it sounds like. Wow. Where the faces are so cold. Mysterious. Somebody thinks they can't figure you out. You're very mysterious to somebody. So maybe they came for you and they were told something else. And now they're like, man, this motherfucker. Like, how? Like you, because you're mysterious, I feel like it's difficult for them to do whatever this shit is they came to do. Okay. Seems we're wasted away. Somebody's just wasting away with what they're doing. That's it. You're not wasting away, are you? So somebody else is wasting away. Get back home. They could be far from where they really are from. I want it. Yeah, somebody's definitely running from the law here. Jealousy, your relationship. Okay? They were fired. They were fired from their job. That's why, you know, they can't provide. I'm guessing if they're a karma father and they're fired from their job, then they can't actually provide for, uh, you know, for their child. So let me see. Tell me what the ancestors got to say about this, please. Water could be a water sign you're dealing with here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, possibly. Sometimes it's not for day. Somebody's not eating every day or yeah. Somebody came for a fucking healer here. That's what this is. So somebody came for a healer. Damn, man. Teacher, yeah, they came for some a, a teacher, an ascended master, a master healer. And now I, I see <laughs> why this is all happening. I want to get some letters here. I feel like this person is wanted, dead or alive. So they could. So with that, that shine the light, shine the light. They came for somebody, and the light got shined on them for because of whatever reason. And it's it fucked up because this person was probably supposed to be very low key. But they came for uh, a healer, okay? And, and I'm guessing that your mysterious healer ways are also psychic. 
and they just had they shine shine a light on themselves. Let the midnight special. Somebody could have a gun. Tell me that like this. E. E. T. That's you. <laughs> let me first off. Let me just tell you. Um, let's just stop here for a minute. They came against another type of being. Do you feel me? Uh, for those of you who know who you are, they came for an extraterrestrial here. Fifteen all. They, I guess that's why you're so mysterious. Let me see what else. The T H E. Okay. A six string on my back. Yep, I might not make it back. Somebody may not make it back to wherever they were, they thought they were going. Wow. Okay. Ooh. The what? Please, the what? The T. The T T. <laughs> Wanted. D.O. Oh, the debit, the debt, or someone's in debt. Somebody could have been trying to hack your, your debit card with the DBT. Somebody could also be on EBT. They could be on government benefits illegally. Oh, hold on. I want to get some... Vows here. Vows, they could be married. Tell me more. So this could be debt. D E B T. Tell me more. Okay, the debt. That's what this is. I don't know what TP is. Um, So with the gambler thing I saw with the prostitution, somebody could have had a gambling problem and they got themselves in debt. I want to rock. Yeah, the debt, the debt, the debt. So they were in debt. I don't know if this has something to do with why they got fired. They could have been borrowing money from work or they stole from work possibly to fix this debt. Somebody's in, in, a, in a jam here. Why, why, why does this have to do with you? No, 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 no. So yeah, someone of your ancestors is like, no, 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 no. Not to play. They were told not to play with you. No, 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 no. Somebody wanted the rock. So like, let's rock. I feel like your ancestors are like, no, you wanted the rock. Let's rock. Yeah, somebody is getting rocked right now. Tell me more. Tell me more, please. Can't have an adult conversation with this person. It's a know-it-all. Genius. They think they're a genius. Ha, <laughs> look at that. Or you can't because you're a fucking genius. So maybe the, okay, thank you, spirit guides. This is it. Remember I told you how I thought someone was going to be, they thought they were going to be able to confuse you when they talk to you. Like they thought they were going to be able to pull the wool over your eyes because they were sent by possibly somebody that you knew or something or about a situation. They wanted to get information and see how much you knew or what you said and were going to possibly record you. You know how this goes, but a lot of us are going through the same thing. You're a genius. So you this is why you probably could read someone's aura and you're like, I can just see that I can't have a conversation with this person, not to be disrespectful or whatever, but I'm on a different level now. I have my awakening. You're, 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 I, we're, we're geniuses, chosen ones, we're geniuses, okay? And it's like, it takes levels to get there. I'm not saying like, we just know everything overnight, but we're, there's, there's a lot we do know, okay? And a lot we don't know too. And that's the first thing of a genius is you admit how much you don't know, okay? But this person thinks they're a genius. I feel like you're smarter than them. This is somebody who feels like they're smarter than everybody else until they came for whoever you are, okay? They don't feel so smart anymore. You can't talk to this person because you're on a completely different level mentally with your IQ and everything. Tell me some more about this. All men love me. Why don't you? <laughs> Somebody's wondering, like, why do you want to talk to me? How come you're not looking my way? Look, I'm going to tell you something honestly. Like, for me, I don't really talk to nobody. So I don't want nobody to take no shit personal. I'm going to be honest. I, I don't talk to a lot of people because I've been betrayed by a lot of people. I think there's people who are taking it personal that a lot of uh, us oh, spiritually awakened people, empaths, uh, introverts, 
we're not talking to a lot of people. It's because we're healing from a lot of betrayal and hurt. Just because we're not showing it and we're not like on the ground crying with our uh, makeup running down our face, you know, whether you're a dude or a chick, it don't matter. It doesn't mean that there's not something deeper going on there. You know, it's like people think that because you still smile and hold your head up high that you're not still dealing with shit. It's like, I just don't wear it. You know, so it's like, it's like, just respect that shit and don't take it personal. I think somebody's taking something really personal here, but if they had ulterior motive, it doesn't really matter. Okay. Yeah. King of swords. They like to have control or it's a narcissist. Okay. It could be an air sign of a Gemini Libra Aquarius for some of you. Look, they're definitely, they're spying, listening, listening. Let me see. Tell me more. Tell me more about this, please. Yeah. You're an introvert. what I tell you? Virgo, you could be a Virgo or this person could be. But I feel like they just sit to themselves. Look, oh, domino. That's what's playing. So domino effect. There's something about the domino effect here. Remember how we say that they're all falling like dominoes? This could be one of those people that are falling or they're about to fall. Okay? Think it's time for a change. You may get disgusted. Start thinking that I'm strange. So you may be disgusted by this person. Or you think that they're weird or they're strange or something. Or they think you think this. Because I don't know. I... I <laughs> about what is worse and what is best so you're like I don't have to worry I just stay to myself and I let them all fall like dominoes <laughs> oh Romeo somebody thinks they're a Romeo that's what this is I love y'all girls lord have mercy right the domino <laughs> uh, let me see why is this hermit here yeah they're in karmic energy here I also see you in this upstanding energy where you just sit to yourself, you're confident, you know who you are, and you're like, listen, I know I'm a badass and I'm a genius, I have to stay to myself, okay? I can only commiserate with certain people, I can't do, I can't just talk to everybody. Somebody, yeah, you sit in a house by yourself, I feel like this person does too, like you're, um, but this is the thing, like, when you sit by yourself, you create things, or you heal, or you have these aha moments, or you're, you're like, you're healing, you're purging emotions, some of you are like, you know, you're, you're getting angry or you're getting upset and you're crying and it's healthy because you're purging emotion. You're, there's no need for argument. There's no argument at all. Somebody trying to start an argument with you. They're trying to get you to fight or they're trying to get you to react. Truth. This means you can call. Yeah, I feel like somebody's trying to get a rise out of it. I've seen the, the um, Empress card, the a Divine Feminine and, and a Leo possibly. I've seen the strength part, or you're just too strong. If you're a female, you're just, oh, look, I just saw divine feminine, divine masculine. Cause so this could be a divine feminine and divine masculine neighbor. Okay. For those of you that doesn't resonate, it's, you know how it goes. I just saw the sun card definitely could be a Leo here, but somebody like you sit to yourself because you can. Okay, you could be a Virgo or a fire sign, but I don't think that shit even matters. I think you're just like, I'm cool by myself. You know, these are people that they're, they can't be by themselves. They can't figure out how you can. Just like we can't figure out how they can't be by themselves. Like we could be by ourselves our whole life. Okay. Yeah, you're secure uh, in your relationship or you're just secure. Okay. I also think that, um, Somebody may be realizing, they may be like looking shit up because she's looking in the computer that they're with a karmic, that they're married to a karmic. It could be a man finding out he's with a karmic female or or the opposite, okay? Tell me more, please. Tell me more. Yeah, look, they're, they're look, they were expecting some shit. Mm-hmm. I feel like they were expecting to like either lie on you or steal from you or do some dirty shit here. Truth. They see that you have stability here. You're okay. You can handle yourself. You can you can uh, take care of yourself. Okay. And this is probably why they were like probably secretly right now 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 in this energy it's like he sassy sneaky slick right thought that they were gonna what have their ships coming in off of fucking stealing from you for some of you your neighbor thought they were gonna rob you or steal from you whether this is like literally like getting to know getting to know you and, and taking from your purse or or um look someone's experiencing psychosis here because of some shit here but or they were gonna this could be your your phone or your because when I mean, they get that close you know there's always something you know you know how it goes right 
to go to church and pray. So this, to some of you, it's a phony Christian you're dealing with or they're connected to one. It's trying to lose weight in unhealthy and dangerous ways. So I don't know if this is them or this could be somebody uh, that they're with. This person could have been heavy. They're losing weight in strange and dangerous ways, right? Or unhealthy ways. What's that? It's usually like bulimia, anorexia, um, or through, um, you know, speed. I'd like you to come to my house. So somebody was really like, Maybe they, they were hoping that you were going to invite them in or, or that you guys were going to hang and then it would give them um, a way to kind of like befriend you and build some kind of false trust. Have you made any changes in your life in the past year? Yeah. I mean, I feel like you did. Okay. They didn't. Somebody here didn't make any changes. So you did. And that's why. So if this person was sent by somebody you, you had some kind of issue with or something, or you knew they haven't, you haven't seen them in a while. I don't think you're anywhere near the same person. So it's like, you can't use that, them same tactics. This may have worked a year or two, put it how it fits ago, but it's not working with you now because you're, you're a completely different person. You cannot come against genius energy. Um, you know, with some hooked on phonics shit. Okay. All right. These people really do think that they're smarter than you. And, and like, we're not even the kinds of people that walk around with a fucking sign that says it. Like, it just, we figure it out when we're in these situations. That's how we figure out how clever and smart and how far ahead we are is when we're actually tested on the shit, you know? Every day our characters are tested. Every day I plan on um, winning, okay? Passing, so... Fatigued or tired. Yeah, this is, I think this is a father. This person could be a father or it's just that toxic masculine energy um, that we talk about. Okay. So let me see. This Sagittarius, there could be a Sagittarius father or they're the father of a Sagittarius here. What's up? Somebody's constantly in their head about this, this father. I feel like, tell me about this, please. Either they're a father yeah, I, you were, you were, you're protected from this person. Whoever this is, you're protected. Yeah, you're protected from this because, or you're protecting yourself. You knew you were guided or you were given some kind of spiritual messages or warnings to like move away from somebody or not go near somebody because you knew that this, they were just trying to put an end to something in your life. For some of you, it was actually you. Okay. Yeah. This is also like my kidnap and tie up card. Somebody could have wanted to torture you physically. There's a lot of swords here. Somebody's in their head a lot. I feel like somebody didn't realize also how spiritually protected you were and it's freaking somebody out because they could have been doing some like, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, you know what I mean? Yeah, look. Look at all these swords. What the fuck is all these swords about? There's something about a big sum of money here or they think you or you're coming into something. Maybe this is why you're being protected because there's some kind of like manifestation that's coming or they're trying to block this or something. Yeah, Pisces energy here. Pisces. So there may be news, some, some news that came out about a Pisces, okay, that had somebody all up in their head here. There's a Pisces. There's some kind of news that came out, possibly about a father of a Pisces, or this Pisces is a father. Gemini energy as well. What 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 is this news that came out? Whatever this is, it's justice for something. Oh, the death. Look at this shit. There's something about a death of a father here. It could be a Pisces, a, a Sagittarius, a Scorpio, whatever this is. There's news that came out and it got somebody all up in their head. It, it's a, yeah, it's justice. Uh, yeah, that's what this is. That they lied about it. They had something to do with it with the Seven of Swords. They were trying to keep this from coming out. Yeah, it's a family member. If there's so the how is this connected to you? I got Scorpio and Pisces here. Are these two family members here? For some of you, they're family members. Yeah, there. Um, hold on a second. I want to get some more information on this and find out. All right, these these are these are these. If you have two, do whatever this is. There's toxic male energy around somebody. Toxic as fuck. Bald. I just seen bald. Somebody could be bald. Okay, doesn't have to be secretly in love with you somebody that actually that is like i don't know no, let's just leave that on the bald i saw bald again somebody that's bald is secretly in love with you okay gave out your phone number somebody gave your phone number out karmic feminine there's a karmic feminine involved in this situation Oof. tell me more 
steals from their mother's purse. So their mother could be this karmic feminine here and they steal from their mother. I'm hot blooded. Somebody's hot blooded. They're short fused. They get fired up real easily. Like a hothead. They're a hothead. Family secrets. There's family secrets coming out here about their family. And I'm guessing it's because of this death of this father. This comes out a lot where there was a death of a father exposed and somebody didn't like that somebody exposed it. So they're trying to send family members to somebody or people to move near somebody to be their neighbor. Won't you be my neighbor? No. As I say, like, what's this love that neighbor shit? Dama was somebody's neighbor at one point, right? So it was Manson. They were all neighbors. Fuck love that neighbor. Yeah, not in this matrix. F. F R. Somebody's name could be Frank or Fran. F F R. What you doing? F P. F P L T. Hmm. Flip. Somebody could be flipping out. You know who. So you know who, you know who this is, or you're on to them, or something like that. Of a hundred and three. Flip shit. Yeah, F L I P. The flip script. Flip. Tick. Kit. Kit. Hold on. Should I leave you my key? <sighs> pesk. A pest. Or pesky. Pesk. I don't know. Flat. Will you be ready when I call your bluff? You called somebody's bluff. Past. This could also be past. The past life. That's what this is. Look at this. Oh my God. I love this shit. P-A-S-T. I'll put it this way for you guys. P A S T. L and then F E. I mean, we don't even need, right? We don't even need past life. This is someone from your past life, okay? That came, and this is why these people are being brought to you. They're not spying on you, they're not uh, gang stalking you. The universe is bringing them to you so that you can get even for shit that these people did to you in a past life, some of them in this life, okay? Um, and that is why this is happening. So I don't know. Um, it's, it's really irrelevant whether the ones on the other side believe it. Like we know this, we've proven this shit. You know what I mean? It just so happens like there's look, a liar, an entire family and they, and they all look similar. And it's just like, you know, I mean, when, I'm going to keep that to myself. There's some shit I just can't say that somebody thought you were a damsel in distress. Like you were weak or you were, hee <laughs> hee. I don't know. Somebody told somebody, yeah, they're easy. They're giddy. They're this. Like, you, it's going to be simple. I, yeah, it's not simple. Mm -mm. Every night, somebody ha has like narcissistic rage. Like, everybody, or every night, everybody. Somebody could be on heroin. Yeah, I feel like somebody's on, uh, they're on heroin or something. Or a judge. I'm a little bit high. Yeah, somebody's high on something. Dope. A judge. Let me find out about this judge thing. Even flow. You're very balanced. You have even flow. Thank you. So, so I don't know. A uh, page of cups. Oh, they'll lose us. Oh, they'll, right? Uh oh. Ain't that America? America. For some of you, uh, not all of you, but they're like some. Yeehaw! Okay. There's a black man. 
Some of you, it's, it's a African American. For some of you, it's not. But how fits? I, I feel like there could be a child, or they were gonna offer a, a fire sign something. What? What's this? There's a woman. I'm just listening. They could have wanted to maybe offer if you could be a if you have if you're an earth sign and you're with a fire sign, the king of wands and the queen of pentacles, they could have been offered something to try to to try to keep you uh from from going somewhere or to keep yeah, Empress. Let me see something. Yeah, page of swords. I feel like I feel like somebody was paid to lie or spy, possibly by a mother. With the Queen of Pentacles and the Empress, this could be somebody's mother offered somebody something to do this. Yeah. Death. Somebody could have been offered something to, to take out an Empress here. Just kind of came and went. Yeah, something came and went. Like, I feel like a lot of times, like, why? <laughs> they could they could have offered uh, a Scorpio money to try to uh, offer you something or befriend you. That's not for everybody. But I, I feel like little pink house. And, um, I feel like. It's a very small offer, though, like. This could be a child, there could be a child of a fire sign involved in this somehow. That's in jail. A child of a fire sign that's behind bars with the eight of wands, possibly because of a death in the past. That's what this is. So there's something with the judge. There could have been a court thing that happened with this. Okay. Why is this neighbor, if this person is in jail, why is this neighbor connected to you? This ain't going to be for everybody, right? But that that's what I'm picking up for this is somebody. What are we on? 36, that's it? Okay. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Let's see, let's get one of these. Well, there's people, there's losers. What do they know? No, no. So these people didn't know enough about you. They didn't know anything. Mexico. Somebody could live in Mexico or be from Mexico. Suffering in silence. Some, and there's lo there's winners and there's losers. You know what side you're on, okay? If you came to spy and fucking do dirty shit, you're the loser. If you're the one they're doing it to, you're the winner. It's just, that's just like that. Nine and nine. Yeah, we all know what nine, nine, nine is about, okay? Nine to nine. Somebody is like trying to cause disruption. They wanted you to suffer, okay? Somebody's also suffering because they see you constantly bringing in some shit here. Yeah. Tell me about this. Yeah, emotional loss. Hmm? You went through a lot of loss to bring this in, okay? I feel like a lot of you did suffer in silence. This is like your dark night of the soul and shit. So if somebody came to for you while you're going through a difficult time or this could have been the past, the, the big mistake. Somebody made a big mistake here. Somebody else is losing all of their material harvest, if you want to put it that way. They're suffering in silence. They're not showing it. This is what creates narcissistic rage. Okay, they suffer by themselves. They cry. They have fits or whatever because they're losing money. Okay, yeah, and they're mad. That's why they're losing money. This is why they're losing it because of this energy. As long as you're in this energy and you're mad and blah, and then, you're gonna lose. Period. Man. Yeah, they're mad because they're stuck. They're mad because they're stuck and you're not. What did you think was going to happen? Were they going to try and make you stuck? This is like, not only, just say in the reverse psychology, this is just reverse, some shit that's happening, but it, put it up, action up, put it in reverse. Yeah, it's reverse. It's like whatever they came to do to you was happening to them, and the more they try to take from you or keep you stuck, the more you keep going. This is the universe teaching somebody a lesson here. The more that you try to stop something for somebody, the more it's going to get stopped for you and they're going to get more. So that's what this is. You got one person here suffering in silence. 
right? And then you got another person here and there's nines on both of these. So I feel like you guys could be in very similar situations here, but one is actually gaining shit and another one is losing shit. And it's because they came here for the wrong fucking reasons. And it's going to keep staying that way. Damn. Couldn't get much higher. Somebody's like really high or they like to get really high or something like that. anorexic somebody could have been trying to make you anorexic or something or or if they were doing some kind of spells or something they could be i don't fucking know somebody wanted you to to like wither away i feel like the initial thing was for you to wither away it's not going to stop till they're in jail or prison out to pasture somebody was trying wanted you to feel like they threw you out the pasture and somebody else is going through that now trying to have you attacked from jail so this person is connected to somebody who's locked up, okay? So whoever this is in jail, they're going to get attacked. They probably already have. They're going to wind up getting like raped or they're going to get attacked or something because that energy is going to come back to them and they're not going to have anywhere to go. It's not like you can hide in there. So be careful, liar. Be careful with the shit you're doing from jail. <laughs> you know, it's easier to run a little bit from your karma when you're free, but when you're just in a cell and shit, you got all these criminals around you, boy, oh boy, the more they come, the more they fall, I told you, that's the universe saying, but then we tell you a million times, you gonna have to take an L, don't act like it's the first time, you motherfuckers been losing your whole life, you just weren't aware of why, now you understand why, okay, your life has been so difficult, because you're not living it right, investigation going on for at least six months, I told you, you, the universe drew this person or these people to you. That's fact. Possibly about a death of a child. There could be an investigation going on for how a child passed away for something. Afraid of secrets getting exposed. So then what? What? So if they came for you, let's just say like you have a platform or a social media page or you could be exposing it. So this, this would be karma in itself. You are karma. You're the karma for somebody. They walked, they, they came to spy on their karma out of narcissistic supply. Mm, 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 mm. Let's do some more letters. Wow. This is like, all right. Tell me more, please. L let me move these. I love you guys. In case nobody told you, L I. L I E. I mean, this could be an L I E, like a lie. Could be, but that blank, it could be a lot of shit. That's why I'm getting another one. Lion. I mean, this could be lion. Oh, they didn't realize how strong you were. Let me see. It could be lo loiter. Like, what is it? Loiting? Is that what they call it? Loiting? How many more? Oh, boil. Somebody could be boiling, too. Mm-hmm. Look, B, look at this shit. Boiling. Somebody's boiling. Period. I feel like they're so fucking mad that shit's getting exposed. Boils. Boils. Let me ask the pendulum. Wow. This person could have boils on them or something. For somebody, for, um, I don't know who, it's not going to be for everybody. This person, if they do drugs a lot, they could have boils or someone they're connected to could have boils on them or something. Can you, and oh, no, I did that already, right? Is this boil, is that what you wanted me to see? Boils? So are they, are, can you clear that? Is somebody boiling right now? Like they're mad. Okay. That's what this is. So whoever this is, they're, they're, they're hot. They're heated. That's why, um, that song came on. Um, what was it? I'm hot-blooded. 
Check it and see. Made me cry. Made me cry. You made somebody cry. No, this mind is not for rent. So don't take it down as arrogant. You can't get, someone can't get into your head. They can't figure you out. And, and I feel like this is you. My mind is not for rent. They can, you can't, you won't give somebody rent space in your dome piece and it piss somebody off. Yeah, and you're like, I'm not trying to be arrogant. I just, somebody, uh, they really thought it was going to be easy to talk to you and to get close, close to you. Yeah, prostitute. Somebody could have lied and said you were a fucking prostitute. This could be a prostitute. This could be someone in the family, their family. If somebody could be prostituting to take what you say about, yeah, it's what you say. So what you say about somebody else, it's like, be careful. Catch the mystery. You're a mystery. You're a complete mystery. <laughs> Somebody could have the prostitute to take care of their family here with the prostitute and the family. Or this is part, somebody that's part of a family where um, they put material things. There may be somebody who feels betrayed because it's like somebody may have to resort to selling their ass here with the Knight of Pentacles on the bottom. Or oh, it was when I split it. There could be somebody that... He gets high on you. Somebody definitely gets high here. This could be heroin shooting up here with the fucking ten of swords. It's reminding me of needles. Somebody could have to like literally do something they don't want to do. Look, hermit. Somebody tries to hide this though. They have tried to hide. I also think somebody told somebody that you were a prostitute. And they may feel betrayed because they're like, fucking what? Like, who, what? They could have, oh, somebody lied and told your family that you were a fucking prostitute. That's what this is. Because of their greedy asses here. Somebody was just like, hmm, I'll get you. Somebody lied and told somebody that somebody was prostituting. And then they wanted you to be isolated and shit. So that, and then what happened? I mean, I, you know, I feel like most of us are isolated, but we're speaking out. So anything that was said, Pisces energy possibly, or, or Virgo. Um, yeah, somebody lied, man. Yep. Somebody may want to apologize too, but I also feel like somebody's greed here is like they have a child possibly with this page of cups. Childish energy at the very least. If they don't have a child, it's childish energy. Somebody's, all, I'm telling you, somebody's prostituting to take care of their child here. What do they think? What do they know is coming? Somebody may want to apologize because they're anticipating something. What are they anticipating? Oh, they were waiting for those ships to come in. Oh, okay. So somebody here with this family and then the Ten of Cups, either with this prostitute, somebody may have wanted to get you by yourself to traffic you. Okay, that's one thing I'm seeing. Another thing I'm seeing here is that somebody feels like betrayed because they have a family with somebody and they have to sell their ass because, you know, there's another person here whose greedy ass is just sitting here like waiting for the fucking ships to come in. Okay, it's like they're just going to sit here like this until, right? Yeah, and then somebody else is like, damn, this sucks, man. It's like, I got to go out here and, and I got to sell my ass to take care of this kid. Somebody also wanted somebody, because of this trafficking thing, I keep feeling like this is a trafficking thing where somebody wanted somebody like this, okay? They wanted everybody to betray you. Your family, the family's out here twice. They wanted your family to turn your back on, to turn their back on you and leave you by yourself and isolated, okay? Because of somebody's greedy fucking ass. But look, look, this all happened too. I feel like for a lot of you, you are by yourself. Your family did turn their back on you. Maybe even your own fucking child too. They probably wanted your child too. The only reason you do shit like this to isolate somebody is because you want to pick them up. You want to do something to them, right? I feel like this all happened and look at you still grateful and shit happy. Like, thank you. <laughs> You did me a solid. I found out who I am. I got stronger. I healed. Thank you. They did you a fucking favor by doing this for you. They did it for you and not to you. That's what it was. We're not going nowhere. I love you. T out.